How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another video. Today is Sunday. Hope everyone had a good weekend. Before we start, I just want to talk about something serious and please, if you wouldn't mind observing a moment of silence for Liverpool's downfall. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I can't even say that with a straight face. I'm so happy about that. Anyway, moving on, let's get into today's episode. We almost done Otamendi, we need to win two more games. Team of the Year Cup we've been playing. We need to win one more game for an 83 plus midfielders pack, three more games for an 83 plus attackers pack, and then the foot positions player pack, which I'm not 100% sure what that is. Looking at SBCs, I no longer want Wayne Rooney. I just think he's a little bit behind the power curve. Ramos and Alonso I definitely want. There's still enough time to complete both of them. Hugo Sanchez, I've decided, is the first person to go for. We need a clinical striker. We've done these two. Very easy. We've done the 83 rated squad and we've done the most expensive. I'll post the picture on the screen now and show you what we submitted. These two squads, so the 87 and the 85. Depending on what we get in packs just now, we are going to use coins for these, which I've worked out will cost us about 250k, which is fine because we'll still have 250k left. The plan is once we get Hugo Sanchez, we just move Mbappe to the left and Sanchez up front. And then when we get Ramos, he's going to come in for Bailly. But to be fair, so far Bailly is head and shoulders above Maldini. This 4-3-2-1 is an incredible formation. So we're going to line up with Mbappe on the left, Sanchez up front. DR to right wing and then everything else as is. Instructions basically stay back, overlap, stay back, overlap. All the instructions for the center mids are the same except Rath cover center, Traore and Ward Prowse cover wings and exactly the same for the front three. Next we're going to check out the content and then we're going to play through the team of the year cup. Hopefully we can get the wins we needed to get some fodder so we can complete Sanchez because I'm very excited to use him. We are definitely missing a striker like that. Let's have a look at what SBCs. Moments, Bora, no one cares. 88 plus prime mids or icon upgrades back. We're not doing that. The draft token, any new icons. No, let's do the daily login and hopefully we can pack something good from the 83 by 10. Worst case, we're just going to get some fodder, hopefully, unless we get all 83s, and that's going to help us with Sanchez. Not going to be me, but hopefully we can get something. At least it's a walkout. Argentina, center forward, Darbala. Not the best, not the worst. First game for today of the Team of the Week Cup. Hopefully we can do this all today. Three wins in five games is doable. And we're going to get some Ready Knox packs from that. And then we're going to complete Sanchez. First game of the night, Milano AS. Everyone's got an insane team in this game mode because of Max Cam. And obviously everyone's got at least one team of the year, which for this case is Modric. Jozinho is very good. That's a nice team. Hopefully we can pick up the win. Good goal there from him. I feel like we should have been a little bit stronger there in the challenge. One nil to him. I think we can pull this back though. We will score one of our chances eventually. Just hopefully he doesn't score again before that. Oh, that's a hell of a ball that. Ah, oh, you need to do something about that, Maldini. 2-0. Lovely play there. Who was that? Diata, obviously. 2-1 back in the game. Come on, big last 15 minutes. That's going to be game over. Good game. The sky wasn't bad. Three out of four would be a tough ask, but I think we can do it. On to the next game. Second game, FIFA 19 PTSD. Where have I seen that name before? Nick around the foot market. Obviously not him. That's a slightly better team. Red and Barpe must be nice. And Jozinho again. Oh boy. Lovely header from Maldini. He's actually starting to warm up to me. That's like the third, maybe fourth header that he scored like that. And he's defending much better. But he's still better though. Come on, Diata. Oh, you need to score that. Please leave. Yes, come on. One win, which unlocks the pack. Two more to go. Three games. Kevin De Bruyne, Bellingham or Modric would be unbelievable. But just fodder, 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 fodder. 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 Okay, that's, that's nice actually. I'll take that. Hopefully some more fodder. Untradeable FC, Eric Ten Hag. Ooh, this team's going to be absolutely fire with Ten Hag. I am so scared. Not even cap. Love you, Ten Hag. 
Don't you just want to rub his bald head? No? Yes? Let's see what kind of team this man's got. Peaky Blinders. Peaky Blinders. So original. Uh, da, 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 da. Who's playing up front? Yeah, that's a nice team, but hopefully we can get the win, and then we just need one more after that. Oh, where Oak? Yes, yes. Yeah, well, this guy we're playing must be so cool. He's probably vaping right now. With a monster in his hand. No, that's going to be one nil. Ah, uh, kind of annoying. I think we can get back in this, though. It's been a pretty even game so far, though. Come on. Yes! Come on, one all. I know it's not that big of a deal, but... If I win this one, then I only have to win one out of the last two, and it would be really nice if I didn't have to do this again tomorrow. Ah, oh, that was too easy. There was a second there where I could have offside trapped, but I didn't. Hopefully, we're going to put it on all-out attack. Hopefully, we can get a goal and take this to penalties. Mikko Arteta, and he has ass in his name, so... Yeah, should be an easy one. I really hope so. I, I know I can, and I will do this tomorrow or the next day, but it's just been asked to get it done out of the way now. Let's see one of... Arsenal is beast. Okay, it's fine. This guy's 11, clearly. Yeah, no, no. This one, he's using Vieri up front. So, yeah, easy one. Oh, that's a ball. Thank you. One more, like I said, easy dubs. Woo! Yeah, oh, we, abs we absolutely bang these. Watch this. See that? Dead ball specialist. 1-0. Told you we bang these. All day. Bang! What the actual hell is this guy doing? Woo! Oh my god, the things I would do to get messy. Oh my god. Lovely crown Vafe, please quit. Thank you. One win to go. Last game. Hopefully we can do it. And then we are getting Sanchez, who I'm very, 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 very excited for. Chicky tucker on none. Come on. No, that's not a king penalty. Okay, Stoichkov, he's looking right, which means he's aiming right. He's still... Oh... I think he's going down the middle, right? Oh, what a cock penalty. Thank you. I mean, technically it was a penalty, but I mean, he missed the shot anyway. Me doing that didn't really have an effect, I don't think. Come on, Johan. I will remember this when you when you go into an SBC. Thanks for the memories, brother. Oof. I swear I was very much considering putting Martinez into an SBC, but that man is not leaving my club. Thank you, and we've done it. I know that's not such a big deal, but I'm very happy with that. This new 4-3-2-1 formation is unbelievable. If you haven't tried it, I would highly recommend it. Three players up front just makes all the difference. 83 plus attackers pack, and I'm very curious to see what this position pack, pack is. I know we've got one before, but I don't remember exactly what it was. Also completed a milestone. Let's have a look what that is quickly. Laugh with friendlies. Two players pack. Who knows? That could be the one that we get a team of the year out of. Nice little pack opening to end off the episode before we get Sanchez, which I'm very, very, very excited about. He is apparently unbelievable, and I can't wait to use him. Contains 11 gold rare plays, guarantees 3 forwards, that's actually unbelievable. 380 plus attackers pack, come on, just some fodder. Italians never good, left wing, Chiesa, absolute horrendous pack. Two more 84s, and the man with the whitest teeth in football, bye bye. Okay, worst case scenario, fodder, best case scenario, team of the year. Oh. 
England, striker. Eh, at least, okay, it couldn't have been Harry Kane because he is an honourable mention. Like you saw earlier, it would obviously make sense if I can do this 87 rated team and then have to spend coins on the other one. Let's have a look what we can do. Obviously not Bale or Martinez. I'm thinking about these players. We will see though. Doan definitely. How far off am I? 87, 4 and 85. Whew. This is what I've decided we're going to submit. Obviously the gold players no one cares about. Dohan no one cares about. Him I just did for fodder. Solskjaer is way behind the power curve. We had to buy Jossalu. That's the only player for 19k. Gundogan is just the definition of average. No wonder he was a free objective card. And we only spent 20k on this. Unfortunately, Terry is going in. Very sad. A bit of a legend at the beginning of the series. Let's just have a moment of silence for Terry. <laughs> Thank you. 87 rated squad done, two more to go. Grundle one, Terrier, Solskjaer, let's go. The 85 rated squad is done. The only player here we had to buy for 44.5k was Trap. One more squad to go. We save a couple dupes, discard that, a couple packs, hopefully just something to put into the next SBC or something to get our coin total back up, but we have one squad to go. Minimum of 82 rated in this pack. Hopefully we can get something good. Italy, never good. Center back, Bastoni. We're going to work out on Footpin what the cheapest solution to this is. I'll post a clip of what I submit now and getting Sanchez. Unfortunately, load shedding is about to happen. South African things. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope everyone has a fantastic week. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you soon.